Hello, I'm Craig Wolf. Perhaps you remember me as the man who brought you the news the past two decades. Well, now I'm switching gears, exploring the awesome Florida lifestyle. As your host of Florida Explorer, What is it like to hook a tarpon? Imagine you cast your fishing line into a busy freeway and you hook a Kawasaki. And the Kawasaki jumps and tail walks and reflects incredible tropical colors from its scales. As the tarpon's about to jump, you can see the line rising, 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 and just this rocket ship appears. It's a thrill. This is Doc Ford's second annual tarpon tournament. It's for a wonderful cause. Dane Darling Sanctuary on Sanibel. It's all catch and release. The tarpon is, in my opinion, one of the most beautiful animals on Earth. When that first tarpon was caught in 1885, the news spread around the world. It changed not just the history of Southwest Florida, it changed the destiny of Southwest Florida. I'm standing here on Fifth Avenue South in the heart of beautiful Naples, Florida, home of upscale boutiques and restaurants, luxury cars and yachts, and waterfront mansions. But just a few miles away, it's an entirely different story. Like here in Immokalee, where nearly 40% of the people live below the poverty line. Once a year, the Naples Winter Wine Festival reaches across this divide with one charitable mega auction. We raised the money for Collier County Kids. We've given away $107 million. There'll be elements of travel and private jets and boats. All have a fantastic, can't be bought anywhere else factor about them. Fanfare signals it's time for the auction to begin. All right, there's one now. One twenty. Often, patrons bid far above top dollar for the lots, knowing the good the proceeds will bring. When I'm in my office in the swamp, uh, it's a total escape. I'd like to tell people it's full contact photography. My name is John Brady, and I'm a landscape photographer. Well, these are some of my Florida images. After being awed by John's images, I was eager to meet him in the field. We're out in the Big Cypress Preserve this morning. It encompasses a big chunk of Collier County. You look out here in the distance, you can start to see the shape of the cypress dome. I know if I was a big gator, that's probably where I'd be right now. I look for a place where the light looks like it's just perfect. We tell I'm inspired. And that'll do it. We just made an image. Now we can pull it back out into the light. are off the beaten path. When people come here, they know that they're gonna eat something that was recently swimming that day. We unload the crabs and weigh them right here and they go right into the crab room. 74. We have 17 crabbers and fishermen that we keep in business. The swinging knot. We are by far most known for blue crab. So, you didn't need a hammer. This is gonna be for our shells. Put some muscle into it. Whack. You're gonna get dirty. It's a great thing to sit down and pound down some spicy crabs, drink cold beer, and hang out with your best friend. And that really is what our restaurant's all about. 